Hello. No. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to my Amiibo Tournament. 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 Take two. You got it. Take two. I did the first one, and I messed it up badly. I don't want to do that again. Let's do this right. I'm saying that to myself, by the way. Look at my beautiful Amiibo children. They will all fight. They will all entertain us. They will show us their power. All 32 of them. Here's a little glimpse of all the Amiibos that are entering. I warn you, there are boss Amiibos in this in this bracket right now. There are boss Amiibos, but I will only tell you when they fight. Only when they fight. Some of them you recognize, some of them you don't. But guess what? I'm not going to tell you these. I'm not going to tell you their stats. I'm just going to comment on what they'll do. Shuffle. Wait. Hold on. Shuffle, 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 shuffle. I was too lazy to edit the title. But next time I'll do it. I'll, next time I'll edit it. But anyway, let's start. The Super Smash Bros. Ultimate Cup Tourney. The Super Smash Bros. Amiibo Tourney. Practice. First battle. Kingzilla versus Dragon Soul. I think I might know who will win, but I'm hoping I'm wrong. The rules of this battle, by the way. No items. No stage hazards. I only made specific stages legal. Um, no final smashes. They're going to fight. Oh, and it's three minute time battle. They're going to fight with their own strength because obviously we want to see the amiibo strength, not worrying about items or any of that stuff. Some of them do know how to deal with items, but don't worry. No items this round. So right now, Kingzilla vs. Dragon Soul. By the way, there are three stages that I accidentally put in here when I didn't mean to. Because of my Joy-Cons drifting. But thankfully, in this video, I'm using my Pro Controller. Yeah. You gotta love Bowser's forward smash. Like, talk to the feet. Sorry, I hear my sister. I'm like, what is she doing? I think she's watching TV. Anyway, oh, as we already know, Bowser's considered broken because he's smart. His AI is smart. I don't believe that he's broken. I mean, he is powerful, but I don't believe him to be broken. I mean, you know, people try to make a worse Bowser amiibo, but he still kind of can hold himself. It's mostly the fact that if he's broken based on what you give him. Like, this Bowser to me is fair because he's powerful, and, you know, he's just powerful. But I gave him the ability where he has better recovery, because, you know, his recovery is okay, but not the best. Come on. Please, Dragon Soul, get him. I gave you a- oh my goodness, Dragon Soul, why did you- One thing I don't like is that my amiibos like to jump. You know how in some of training, training, I usually do my best not to jump so much. They jump regardless. It's in their program to jump. That's slightly annoying. I mean, I guess in in tournaments, players like to do jumps to throw other, the opponent off. But do they always gotta jump? Ugh, never mind. Come on, follow it up. You know those dash attacks really get on my nerves. I'm oh oh, I shouldn't have said anything. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I felt that was unfair. Oh my goodness, Kingzilla, you gotta calm down. You gotta calm down, please. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> and he's taunting. Get out of here. Oh my goodness, you can't do that. Oh my goodness. Stop taunting. I didn't teach you to taunt. I know you're King Koopa, but that's not fair. Oh, get another one. Get another one. Get another one. No! Oh my, that's not enough. Hit him! <laughs> he dodged it. <laughs> he dodged it. <laughs> Darn it, Kingzilla. You are the worst. Oh my goodness. I feel like he was playing with his food. Kingzilla is such a piece of... <laughs>
What? I, he, I said he was going to be a piece of garbage. What did you think I was going to say? <laughs> oh, he advances. Dark Wings versus Dark and Die. Falco versus Zelda. I actually gave Zelda retraining a, a while, some time ago. And I won't lie to you. She's never fought Falco. And also, she's at a disadvantage. For those, for those of you who remember, Dark and Die has been retrained. She now only heals after knocking the opponent out, so no more auto heals. That was a good parry. Oh, I can't even remember how Dark Wings fights. It's been a while. He's not fully trained, but you know he's trained enough. Ooh, that was nice. I like how they changed Falco's neutral air where he just swings his feathers and hits you. Because usually, if I recall, it was just a kick. Also, when did he learn to... When did... Did I really teach him to snipe with a gun like that? Like, you see him jumping and trying to land those shots? I didn't actually think he would go for that. Woof. I wish he would go for grabs than just to like go in and do air attacks. Oh, I say that and he finally grabs. <laughs> he just downbeat and kicked and kicked it in her face and he just got a KO. Or ki uh, yeah. I keep saying kill, it's KO. They don't kill each other, they KO each other. The one thing I have to say I don't I find annoying about the AI's programming is with Zelda, the AIs don't know that they can reflect the phantom at Zelda, but they just block it or avoid it. They just don't see it that way. The player knows it, but Zelda doesn't. I think it's like with K Roll. K Roll isn't aware well K Roll and Kirby. K Roll isn't aware that his downbeat can not only counter but can reflect projectiles. But the AI doesn't know that. But yeah, K Roll can reflect projectiles with his stomach. Unless they patch that. And Kirby can eat specific items. Like, Kirby can eat Wario's bike if items were turned off. He can also eat specific projectiles. Like, the only thing he won't... Well, he can, but won't... But shouldn't eat are bombs and anything that would hurt him. Otherwise, the, out, the AI isn't aware of that, which I think is annoying. It's like with uh, Peach and Daisy. They don't, they don't use the float ability to recover. It's only, like, on stage. They don't ever use it to recover. But what can you do? No one's perfect. Oof. Okay. D I was afraid of this. Dark and I does not know how to fight Dark Wings. I think this is the first time they fought each other. And she does not know how to deal with him. She does not know how. Yeah, throw him. Like, that's gonna stop him. <laughs> that's not enough. <laughs> Dark and I. No. Oh, she does not know how to fight Dark Wings. This is the first time these two ever fought, I think. Oh, two KOs. Darn it, Dark and Die. Darn it. Gray Fox versus Phantom Eye. These two have fought twice. In my practice amiibo tournaments, you know, to warm them up before the real tournament. And they traded 1v1. Fox won one, then Link won the other. Now they get to do it again. Who will win this time? Woof! Woof! You guys really love to jump in the air and kick each other in the face, don't you? Okay, Phantom Eye. One, one arrow to the face. Blocked. Second arrow to the chest. Ow. Third arrow. Parry and then eat my feet. Nope. Nope. You, you know what's really interesting about this? Ooh, got him. Do you know what's really interesting about how I trained this Link Amiibo? I've taught him how to, like, you troll with the bomb. When I say troll, you throw the bomb like an item, but you don't set it off. 
the opponent gets worried. It's like, what do I do? What do I do? Parry. Nice. What do I do? Because you're like, you're about to throw, you're about to ignite it, but yet you don't. See, he let that roll off the stage. Because I, I forgot, I love I love the fact that, you know, it pressures the player to thinking, oh, it's right there. Should I get rid of it or should I get near it? Oh, that almost KO'd. I meant to say, should I pressure and get rid of it or should I stay away from it? But I ended up saying it the wrong way. See what I mean, though? I, he, he's using that pretty nicely. Still has a lot to learn, but, you know, I, I'm liking the new Phantom Eye. That's still not enough. And we're going to Animal Crossing. Oh, he tried to go for the up B. Come on. Someone knock each other out. I'm trying to think. Didn't didn't Fox get a kill? Oh, he tried to reflect the boomerang. That's death. Yep. The minute he threw him upward, that was death. Fox, why do you... Okay, never mind. It's my fault. There were times I did charge up my smash attacks, but only for like a split second. He charges up for like a split four milliseconds. Three to four milliseconds, man. That's too long. Ooh, double parry, baby. Oh, there is a parry, too. See what I mean about these two? They have a slight rivalry, but... Ooh, right into that arrow. Mm-mm. Link, you gotta stop being aggressive. You gotta stop being aggressive. Come on, be smart. Be smart. Sudden death. Come on. Get him. Oh my goodness, Link, you messed that up. Link, you messed that up. You should have tilted. You should have tilted. Oh my goodness, another parry. Stop it. Get him. Get him. Don't do... I knew you were going to do that, you idiot. You're an idiot, Link. I knew you were going to pull that off. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? I knew you were going to do that. I knew he was going to trigger it because he was near it. His AI. It, Fox jumped away because he saw that. He said, gotcha. Oh, Fox won that because Phantom I goofed. He choked. Phantom I, you can't do that. Oh, Gray Fox is actually improving. That's a little, that's good, but also scary because it's you that's not, well, whatever. Mega Man versus Yoshi. Blue Boom versus Great Dino. Blue Boom has an advantage. It's defense versus attack, so Yoshi might pull this off, though, because he's been doing pretty well with being very aggressive. And by the way, I did try to make it a little fair, because you probably noticed that I had a lot of... Because in the past, I had a lot of neutrals, a lot of defense, a lot... Like, I didn't have a lot of attack or grabs, but I made it fair. I had some attacks, some grabs, some neutrals, because I wanted the... I didn't want characters to have weaknesses, but, you know, sometimes having a weakness is what makes them stronger. And the more they fight it off, the better they adapt, if that makes sense. But I wanted it to be fair. Like, you know, I wanted to have a strong fighting amiibo... A strong defensive, a strong speed, you know. Mix it up. Don't be afraid to mix it up. <laughs> Come on. Okay, great dino. Stop going above him. Can you stop going above him? Like, why do you got to go above him? Stop jumping. What are you doing? Stay on the ground. I'm annoyed because great dino loves to use the flutter attack. Oh, look, you downbeat. Great. Now he knows what you're going to attempt, you moron. See, look at this. Stop going for the flutter attack. Just get him. I can assure you, I did not teach him that. He learned it. I guess Daredevil makes him go for those things. Yeah, again, that's not enough because that was a weak, that was a sour hit. Ooh, we're in Fire Emblem Three Houses. I, I will finish that game eventually. I will finish that game. Because it's been a, a year. How long has I have? I think it's been a year. It's been roughly a year since I've recorded it, and I think next year will be my second year. Or so it'll be two years if I don't get it done, so I do want to 
at least finish the recording because funny as this sounds i have not played the blue lions route yet i've started on it but i haven't fully played it i want to at least finish the golden route for golden deer route first then i want to probably do the evil route the crimson flower which is edelgard you know at least you know understand what each route does so i can just you know understand Curious though, I wonder if they're gonna make a new what new farm mode they might make since three houses. Cause three houses been out since what 2019, I think summer 2019. So it's been three. Uh, it's been three years, I think. Or did it come out 2020? No, it came out 2019 because I didn't get the game until Christmas and didn't start playing it until uh 2020 until 2020. Yeah, great, Dino. You were great, but not good. Like, you were great, but not... Oh, boy. I guess... I guess, uh, advantages do matter. You went in for the hits. Well, he did, he did even more damage. Are you kidding me? Whatever, it's fine. It's fine. Someone call a virtual ambulance. Call, someone call a virtual ambulance because Soul's gonna die. So it's going to be in a, a coma for a, for who knows how long until the game respawns him. He's going to be in a virtual coma. Fist break is going. He he's versing a guy that is weak as a weak and light as a feather, but hits like a dog on rhino combined with a truck at full speed. That makes sense. Soul's going to die. He's going to die. Use those projectiles. Oh my goodness, Perry. Thank you. Watch out. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh. Yeah, I made this little mech a dangerous fighter. Like he's he's literally like very powerful, very powerful. Oh goodness, oh goodness! Stay away from him. There it is. Another like two punches enough to kill you. Two punches enough to two force. Thank you. You need to be very strategic. Two force smashes enough to kill you. He's that deadly. It's Little Mac. What do you expect? Little Mac is deadly powerful, but just weak in uh, defense and recovery. Did you see that? He tried to land the knockout punch after forward smashing. He it missed though. If that if that landed, oh my goodness, that would have been a that would have been a, just a quick. Quick, that would have been like a quick, easy kill right there. I don't know. Look at this. Robin has to keep his distance. He does not know how to use his projectiles. Oh, darn it. Come on, Robin. You got to approach him better than that. Do I need... I think I, I got to retrain Robin. Ooh, he almost, he almost died from that. 62 at one punch. Okay, I don't know why you're fully charging that. No! A shield break and right He ate that. Robin ate that. Robin ate that. Okay, at least the KO's been cancelled. Come on, Robin, do something. Don't just Oh jeez. Robin, survive. Oh jeez. Super armor. Super armor. Super armor. That's not enough. That's not enough. <laughs> That's not enough. No. No. <laughs> Super armor. <laughs> I knew this was a bad idea. Like, ro okay, there we go. He got a kill. I think that's only his second. Whoa, goodness. He... Oh, man. I think Robin needs a retrain. Robin is actually not that... Robin actually has is supposed to have an advantage against against uh, Little Mac. Cause, oh, throw in the towel. Someone throw in the towel for him. Robin is busted. Get him out quick before he needs it. Poor Lucina and Cromer in the background is shaking because Robin's so broken. Look at that. Plus five to negative, negative five to plus five. He got seven kills and Robin only got two. Two or three. Oh man, look at that. 
Oh. <laughs> Robin, I think I might need to retrain you because that was terrifying. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Boss Amiibo alert. Boss Amiibo alert. Can you guess who it is? If you said it's Mario, no, it's Princess Peach. Florine is the boss amiibo, not Mario. Mario used to be so Sonaro used to be burning so, but he finally recovered after being defeated by Lovely Wind, the Peach amiibo. And now he's versing a boss amiibo, Florina. Florina is a bossy, and you're about to see why. She tried to grab him. Why did you reflect that? Oh, Mario. Come on, Mario. Do something. Do something. Oh, don't get smacked but with a heart. Don't get launched. Why did you... <sighs> That's not enough. That's not enough. Okay. Well, you probably already guessed it. She's a boss because she has armor knight. Yeah. And she's defensive. Okay, that was smart. He shot blood at her. Whoop. Oh, yeah. I forgot to cut this out. I'm sorry. Uh, apparently, I forgot to switch my internet to wired. It's right now, this is, it's on wireless, and I don't trust wireless. I trust wired. Now, the funny thing is I'm not online right now, but I do want to, this was uh, before I started playing Pokemon Unite and uploading it. You probably, like, this was all done before... You know, me recording a Halloween video in Pokemon Unite, but you know, I uploaded those first, and then this one, because this one was a bigger project. But I forgot to cut that part out. No big deal. Come on, okay. The fireball would have worked, but she saw that coming. You can't keep using the same move. You know, okay, grab her, grab her, grab her. What did you, why did you up B? She wasn't close enough. Oh my goodness. Come on, Sonaro. Are you holding back because she's Florina? She's already in a relation with a, with a man. Her, <clears throat> oh, thank goodness. He parried that. I thought he was going to get killed. What are you doing? Why are you not dunking? Dunk her. Fist her to the ground. She's like, come on. Marco's not going to be mad. I know that's his wife, but don't be mad. Don't, he's not going to blame you. He wants you to beat her. What are you doing? Marco's her husband, by the way. Florina's husband, Marco, which is another Mario, but it's a Mario that I didn't train. I let the computers train him. Didn't go very well. And he has super armor instead of armor knight, because I wanted to make a defensive tanked amiibo team. Ooh, nice parry. Oh my goodness, you... Sonar, you threw that. You threw that. You th you blew it. Why did you? Why are you so scared? She kicked you, hit you with a crown, hit you with her bottom, and you literally couldn't knock her out. Like, oh my goodness, Sonar, why? It's not lovely when it's her cousin. Doggone it. Whatever. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Viper Man versus Athena. I think I know who might win, but the other might impress me or surprise me. I'm thinking about giving Athena a slight retrain only because I don't like how I gave her spirits. I wanted to remove shield damage, but removing shield damage removes her personality. What in the world? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Viper Man put a C4 on her body and then she jumped up and got blown off stage. 
I didn't even see it though. I don't think she saw it either, but I I'm actually surprised. Why are you why do you keep forward smashing in the Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, I saw that happening. Okay, I like how she's using her auto ridicule and I might retrain. Actually, I'm thinking about retraining her. Not because she's doing bad, but only because there's one move <clears throat> Only because I remember training Athena and there were some things I did not train her proper. Oh, this stage. This is one of the stages I did not want to add. I did not mean to add the boxing. Viper Man just vipered himself by blowing himself up. Don't ask me what viper means. He goofed. Like a complete doof. <sighs> but I'm thinking about retraining Athena. I think I might retrain her. I'm not sure. Dog on it. Dog on it. Oh yeah, that actually did he blow her up or did he up smash? I, I didn't pay attention. Do it again. Oh man. He, okay, she's using the she's using explosive flame way too much. I don't like that. She's using it way too much. Because if she misses, she's wide open. I will say this. I'm glad though she's not like spamming smashes. I kind of should have made her smash a little bit more. Because, I mean, Explosive Flame is good. But, you know, don't use it if, you, if you're if you not going to get it to attack. Or get it to connect, I mean. Okay, he rolled into that. Uh-oh. Uh oh, uh oh, move! Oh, why did you do that? Why did you do that? Why did you do that? Why would you bounce? That's why. Oh. Athena wins because of Viper Man's stupidity. Phantom Dragon versus Blue Phantom. Mmm, Phantom Dragon is my favorite, so is Blue Phantom, but I'm scared that Blue Phantom's gonna knock him out because of this, because he's a grab. Blue Phantom has an advantage for being a grab, and Phantom Dragon is defense, so you saw how, how Dark Wings took out Dark and Die, and how Mega Man took out Yoshi because of advantage. So, how's this gonna go? You know, I want, the one thing I like about Blue Phantom is he likes to use his spring and hurt the enemy, which I think is somewhat good, but also bad, because you're wide open if it if it miss <clears throat> if it misses. But I think he he fixes that by using the down air, which is stupid. I won't lie, I did do a lot of down airs, but I was trying to spike him. Cause funny story is that you can actually spike your opponent off stage, and as long as you don't use your double jump. You can double jump, up B, and if possible, side dodge onto the ledge, and then Sonic won't get himself KO'd. But the Amiibo won't do that. The Sonic Amiibo won't pull that off, but he will down air if you, if you use it enough. Except the way Sonic uses down air is like a, it's like a, it's a lure. It's like, oh, I'm vulnerable. Not. Sonic is playing very weirdly. Phantom D Dragon is doing okay, but Sonic is playing very woo. That was actually good. He neutral air, landed, and then just forward smashed. That was actually a very interesting strategy. At least he's using other attacks. You know how many times Sonic runs around and uses forward, I mean up smash? Okay, I have to say, I'm very proud. He just used the neutral B. 
And he just got countered. Okay. He just used the neutral B. Do you know how many times I've been trying to get this boy to use neutral B? And he wouldn't use it. He finally uses it. Why did my amiibos taunt me like that? Like, what did I do to make... Oh, yeah, I beat them up. <laughs> okay, that was good. Phantom Dragon's coming back. That was good. He's coming back. He's adapting. He's adapting. I don't think he's ever fought Sonic. Or maybe he... No, he has fought Sonic, but Sonic got retrained. So now it's like a... Sonic is acting differently. Out of all the times, that was the first time I've seen him up smash. Because like I said, he's up smashed way too much previously. But I'm so glad he's mixing everything up. Because that's the one thing I love about Amiibos. They use their own attacks each, at least once each time. Don't you start spamming that up smash. I'll spank you again if you do that, boy. Stop up smashing. Oh, that should have killed. Come on, you gotta get the kill, Phantom Dragon. You gotta get the kill. Get in there. Don't let him, don't let him jump away. Hit him. Dog flipping fish paste. See? One more kill, you would have sudden death. You would have hit sudden death if you... Oh my goodness, look at that. One more, it would have been sudden death. But he goofed. Don't let the hedgehog get away. This is Robotnik said. Don't let that hedgehog get away. Oh no. I know who's gonna win. I won't say who, but I know who's gonna win. <sighs> well, I retrained Ike, and he came out pretty well. But now he hurts even more. Ooh, that! Oh, Daisy, why did you like? Why did you not grab that? That would have been your key to, to, to victory. The one thing I can't stand about Daisy's AI is when she keeps using the doggone, the doggone, um, you know, air attack and the, the little feet kick, whatever that move is, the down air, the down attack in the air. Oh, you know, I forgot to tell you what time I started recording. I started recording the first one around 11 something in the morning, 11:50 I meant to say, and I stopped at 1 uh 1 10 because yeah, 110 because or not 110 but 106 because I messed up the I messed up on something and I didn't want to you know I messed up when it came to commentary so I had to redo it. Because I wasn't satisfied at all with what I was talking about. Oh. oh my goodness. Why didn't you use Toad? Why didn't you just counter that? Oh, that almost broke his shield. Oh, I was going to say, if you gonna, are you going to like go into his sword again? It hurts, Princess. It hurts. Thank you. So, but you need to catch up. You got more kills than you did. Don't you jump into that, okay. Okay, just stand there and pick up a vegetable while he hits you in the head. Finally, you're doing something. Finally, you're doing something. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, that that would have been that would have been amazing if that hit. See, why do they spam that move? Stop spamming it. It's per, it's it's in her it's hard coded into her oh jeez. It's hard-coded into a program. It doesn't work. It's annoying to use. I mean, you don't you need to understand. That's like a, a retaliation move. That move should not be in your program. Just I know the uh, tip of it, or at the end of the attack, has good knockback, but come on. Like, come on. Stop spamming it. Look, look what it's doing to you. You're dying, Daisy. Use something else. Use something else. Why would you pick up the vegetable when he's charging you like a dog or an animal? Okay. You got a KO. That's what, your second one? Oh, jeez. Just fall back right on the blade of... Oh, my goodness. If that finished off, you'd have gotten burned. Get out of my sight, princess. 
That's exactly what it is. See, look at those. Look at that look in his eye. Look at what that says in his eye. Get out of my sight, princess. Get out of my sight because you're not. Look. Okay, so you, you just needed one more kill, but still. Oh, my goodness. Why? I'm playing. I'm just kidding, by the way. She did good. I mean, that, for her uh, stats, I was impressed. She 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 wasn't she didn't you know fall back that that far. Why is this what? Why is this stage activated? Did I? How did this stage get added? I didn't activate this stage, or did I activate it because of the drifting? Gore planes. Oh no! Wait, gore guard planes. This stage is not, this stage is banned. I don't know how this got in here. I could have sworn though that I, oh my goodness. I'm trying to think. Maybe I activated when I was trying to activate the other stage. Was this above Persona stage or something? I know for the fact that I hit A to turn it off. <sighs> Stupid Joy-Cons. You just took the hammer. This is, this is actually not very good. I mean, the Amiibos are going to stay on the two platforms. Metalhead will not appear, but still, this stage is bad. Because, I mean, there are so many platforms at the bottom. If you fall in the middle, you got to make your way back. Come on, Kerjack. You could have... Oh, my goodness. What are you doing? See, look at this. You're making a fool of yourself. Look at you charging into Frost King's face, and, you're, and he's just blocking you. He's making a fool of you. Use your... Use your brain, not your fist, banana breath. Use your brain. I know you're a gorilla of bruised strength, but doggone it. Use your brain. I'm not impressed. Get another kill. I don't know how to make Donkey Kong a genius. I just don't. I know he's, you know, all about strength, but come on. Is this, is strength, is, all, is that all it is to you, just to be strong? You eat bananas just to eat strength? Bananas do more than give you strength, and I don't mean give you good strength, they just give you strength and other problems. <laughs> like, literally, how do you make Donkey Kong smart without... Oh, boy. Look at that. Look at that, come on. No! <laughs> oh my goodness! He... <laughs> <laughs> it's obvious of who's gonna win. Cause Kerjack doesn't know. Look at this. Frost King is, is not impressed. Kerjack, what are you doing? What are you doing with yourself? I did not train you to do all that. I promise you, I did a I gave you a good training. You literally are a stupid monkey right now. You are literally stupid. Oh my goodness, parried again. You are, you're getting parried. Kerjack, what are you doing? What are you doing? Double, like, that's my favorite move right there. The down roll, the down tilt toy. Oh my goodness, that didn't kill. Uh, uh, nope. There. Frost King is pretending to look like he's sweating because look at the difference. Five to three. Five to three. No. Well, oh geez. You, okay, you want to know something that's a, that's a little bit irritating about Plun, uh, Plun Knight? Luigi? Luigi lost to Mario Amiibos on a journey. He lost to a Dr. Mario and a Mario who was wearing the wedding... With the wedding outfit from uh, from Odyssey. For some reason, Luigi just you you saw how Mario loses to Princess Peach. Well, Luigi loses to Mario. I'm not kidding. For some reason, it's like in their program where they just can't win against the per the person they care for. Mario doesn't want to hurt Peach. Luigi Mar Luigi doesn't want to hurt his brother. It's like it's. It <laughs> What is happening? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness.
You know something that's actually there's one thing I have to say I don't like about Plun Knight is that I he's not using his fireballs. Like he won't use his fireball. Oh, right in the face. I'm pretty sure I used a couple of fireballs when I retrained him, but I guess he doesn't want to use them. Hopefully, though, he'll prove me wrong. You see how, you know, Mario and, and Dr. Mario are using their pills or fireball. Luigi's not using his at all. Oh boy, I'm not liking how this is going. See, Plunite's slowing down, I can see it. Do something. See, look, look how many pills the doc is throwing at him. Or, I'm sorry, the professor. Like, I, I can't commentate because I don't know what's going on. What is happening? Why are my amiibos so weird? Apparently, the professor says you're grounded. <laughs> He's your brother, not your father. Do something. Do something. Get him. Get him. He tried to do the up, the surprise up B, but he hit the sour spot. That did not KO. No! Don't get sucked in by that down B. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh, he tried to spike him back, but he's like, nope. Woo, sudden death. Plun night, plun night, plun night, plun night, plun night, plun night. Get him, get him, hit him. No, don't get hit by the pill. Don't jump. The Nightmare Revisits. Plun Knight can't stop getting beaten by his blasted, stinking, blasted, stupid brother. Why do you mess up, Plun Knight? Why is it always that Mario that's your that your crypto crud? Crud. Crud. Two boss amiibos are fighting each other. Gandalf, or Soul Eater, and Or Knight. Ornite is a boss because he has Armor Knight. I tried to give him something else, but Mennonite is just... I, I don't know how to train a Mennonite. So I gave him Armor Knight so he doesn't KO so easily. So no tournaments for him. Unless, you know, unless it's this made-up tournament. But Ganorf is also a boss, but he does not have any broken spirits. He doesn't have Armor Knight. He doesn't have Auto Heal or Knockout Heal. He doesn't have Super Armor. He's just dead, downright powerful. His superior, his spirits are all about about recovery. His support spirits is all about his recovery. A lot of attack because he hits hard. He's coming back. And he's also a bit of an idiot. Oh hi, Nintendo Mario Brothers 4. Ooh, he's, if that went, if he went backwards, that would have been, he has a way to recover, but like I said, Ganondorf is a very fast faller. I could have given him floaty, I was going to give him floaty jump, um, floaty jump, lightweight, and critical hit, because at least with floaty jump, he'll be able to make it, and if he gets hit again, floaty jump will help him come back, but I think I gave him those moves, and it didn't make him better, at least I don't think it did. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. That's not enough. Don't up oh, him. Don't do that. 
It's not enough. Only do it if you know it's gonna kill. Go for oh oh. He's using his down B. That's awesome. He probably already used it earlier, but I wasn't paying it. There we go. See, that's how you use the up B. Don't just hit him with it. Knock him out with it. <clears throat> what are you doing? Why would you? What are you using your your neutral for? Use it on the. Oh my goodness, no, no! Don't do that. Don't do that. You'll get punished. Oh, you are lucky that that didn't break. You idiot! You you should have down be there. Why would you? I don't know how to make a Mennonite good. I just don't. I don't know how to make a Mennonite good. Soul Eater just ate his soul like it was nothing. He toyed with him and then in the end ate his soul. Doggone it. Doggone it. Yeah, feed it to this. Feed him more souls, why don't you? Star Phase on versus Sacred Wind. I love Sacred Wind. You know, she was like my fifth amiibo, I think. Because, believe me, I really wanted a Rosalina. Even if I wasn't good at her, good with her. Star Phase and I did my best. I literally, this girl got a lot of retrain. Star Phase on was so difficult because I don't play Zero Suit. I don't play Zero Suit at all. But I had to at least make her, make her look good. Oh my goodness. And this, now here's the thing with Star Phase on, I did not stay on the ground because technically Star Phase on or Zero Suit is not all that great on the ground. Ow! I hit my, I, I, I hit my headphones. Ow! You know what's really annoying is that she won't use her down B to spike her or to bury her. I've used that a couple of times. She won't use it. She just uses it to evade. Like, look at that. You're using it to recover. Hit her with it. Don't just evade. I mean, I tried at times used it so you so you wouldn't. I should have used it so you could spam it. Come on. She's okay. Why does Starface up keep going for grabs? Why aren't you not using the the uh, Why aren't you not using your Look, why do you keep going for grabs? If you miss, you're going to you're going to get punished if you miss. Hmm. <laughs> well, I didn't know how to make Starface on, but oh, you. Well, this was expected. I mean, they're both they both fly in space, but you know, Zero Suit Samus without her armor doesn't can't really. I don't know. I don't. Uh, you keep grabbing. Why are you a grabber? Why do you keep grab? Oh boy. <laughs> Oh man. Okay, finally you got a kill. Good job. <laughs> this was expected because I gave. Oh, bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye, Zero Suit. Like, I, I just don't know how to make you better. I just don't know how. But hey, you gave us something. How many KOs did she get? One or two? She got two. Yeah. Yeah.
Yeah. Now this is what Samus should have been. This is going to be interesting. Star Nebula versus Lovely Wind. And I, you notice that I capitalized her in because it looked weird all all being low all being, you know, lower leveled. Lower case, doggone it. I want to give Starface on another retrain, but I need to look at look up some things. Because again, I think I know why she. Whoa, that was actually clever. I thought Lovely was about to get herself killed. She side beat off. She side beat off the platforms. That was pretty cool. See. Ya. Stop spamming those the air kicks. It sucks. Stop spamming those. See, look, you got grabbed. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Keep going. Keep going. Okay. Samus is really Star Nebula is really trying to get those bombs. I'm assuming if you get by a morph ball, she'll go in for a grab. We'll try to combo you. Cause I remember. Oh, jeez. Oh no. Don't tell me she's gonna start using that attack. Yeah, she is. Doggone it. Ooh, that was actually pretty good there. I don't know why you just threw that vegetable off the stage. You didn't throw it upward? Oh, this is a Zelda stage. Oh my goodness. Lovely way. What are you doing? Were you. Oh my goodness. Were you just toying with her? This is the amiibo I trained first when I uh, when I uh, first got amiibos. This was the this was the beginning. Lovely wind. She's still lovely. <laughs> oh shoot! Star Nebula is getting angry. She parried them both. You know, starting it would be nice if you could actually shoot her with that plasma blaster or whatever that thing is called. You're just charging it. Shoot her with it. I taught you to fire it. Just fire. Uh, that's a weird right. That's weird right there. She's about to shoot, but Lovely Wind just teleports right behind her and is about to finish her off. Wow. <laughs> Ah, uh, Star Nebula literally thought she had it in the bag, and then Lovely Wind just sped up and... Oh, jeez, this is... Uh, oh, no. This is actually bad. Arasso versus Genetic Soul. Yes, his name is Arasso. Not Oraso, Arasso. These two fought before, and Genetic Soul won. You always wonder why Lucario replaced Mewtwo in, in Brawl, right? <laughs> oh, and Mewtwo was not happy about that. They were not happy about that. Oh, he tried to disable him. Oh, and I forgot Mewtwo is a boss. Mewtwo is a boss. He has Armor Knight. He has Armor Knight. Lucario, or Russell, do something. Don't spam or spears. Don't spam it. Grab him! Force palm him! I don't care! Don't sp- Oh my goodness! It was gonna happen eventually! It was gonna happen eventually! He 
he did a down smash, the double dash into an up smash. What are you doing? And he knows how to warp around. What are you doing with your life, Mewtwo? Oh my goodness, what is happening? Oh my goodness, what is happening? The strongest Pokemon in the world. He's definitely stronger than Lucario. Lucario in general is a, is a steel in fighting. Psychic does not... A steel cannot counter to, counter to like a psychic type. Lucario doesn't stand a chance. Oh no, back to this stage. It doesn't matter. Arasso is still gonna lose. Genetic Soul is literally not breaking much of a sweat. He took a couple of damage. If he had recovered, this would have been broken. But thankfully, this Mewtwo does not recover. But he doesn't need it. He's a boss. Look at him. Dodging and just... No. <laughs> oh, no. Look at this. Arasso has not even gotten a KO. What is happening? Come on, Barasso, don't be scared. Get him. You got. What are you doing? Did you just hit your head on the ground? Look at the. He, he died to his his neutral B, his electric B. I don't know what that move. I don't know what that move is where it shocks the opponent. But uh, Rosso, what are you doing? What are you doing? You you fought him before. Don't tell me you're scared of him. Look, he's taunting. Arasso, do something! Don't- uh, do, get off of that! If he up smashed him, that would've probably been it. Don't get grabbed, don't get grabbed, don't get smashed! That was a terrible ending right there. A terrible ending for Arasso, he gets picked up and sent to the Dark Realm. By Mewtwo, slash genetic soul. He didn't get a single K- Oh! He only did 98%. Are you kidding me? Plun Knight's girlfriend versus General. I wonder who will win. I wonder who will win. And this Daisy is the... This is the Daisy that teamed up with Plun Knight. This was the Mario Party Daisy. <laughs> General got to retrain, by the way, just like Dark Eye did. He got to retrain, so you notice that he no longer heals. He does not heal at all. Don't you? Don't do that. Don't do the fox or the dash dance. You're not even. You're like what? You have what? You got her at 102 percent, 22 percent, and you're almost at 100. You're at 100 percent now. Oh, that was cheap. Dandela is just a weird princess. She, when she gets a good hit, she likes to yap about it. She gets distracted very easily. Okay, dash, dash attacking is okay. Yeah. How many dash attacks did she attempt to, to KO General? What the heck was that? Did I spam that a lot when I trained her? I can't. Re no, I didn't. I didn't spam that. She just learned it. <laughs> or she just did it on her own. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> what was that? General tried to down B or Falcon kick her and he missed and they ended up Falcon, Falcon KOing himself. What the hey? What is going on? What is happening? What have I done to these amiibos? I could have sworn I trained them better than this. What are you guys doing? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Do something. Oh. He landed the knee. He landed the knee. 
Do you realize how rare that is for him to land that knee? The amiibo only landed the knee, I think, after like an up air attack. He just ran up and kneed her. Just gave her the knee of justice. Oh, now you land the Falcon Kick, but you end up KOing yourself because of that. Dandel's gotta get a KO in order for it to be a, a, a sudden death. Get him! Get him now! No, 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 hit him! KO him! Oh, she was too late! She had it, but she was too late! Darn it! She did it way too late! She should have been... Oh. See, look! That's all she needed, just one more KO, but she, <laughs> what it, oh, whatever. Rip, rip, and I'll say it again, rip, rip, because I think I already know who's going to win, but I won't say it. Dark Wings, please. You gotta you gotta show the team of your training. Get them. Oh my goodness, you ran into that. You just ate his fist. Stop eating his fist. Get him. Please. This is round two. We're already to a rocky start with round two. Oh no. Oh thank goodness I didn't KO him. Don't get hit by that again though. Oh my goodness. King Zilla is crushing Dark Wings. Oh boy, he's trying to turn wings into chicken he's turning dark wings into chicken wings. Don't don't do oh not again. Oh my goodness. No space of no no mercy. No mercy. He's hungry. And Dark Wings is on the menu. Okay, I was about to say, Darkwing, you can't. Thankfully, you didn't die to that or KO to that, but oh, in your face with the feet again. And then you 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 did it right back with his with his face with with your foot in his face. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Okay, you're an idiot. I'm surprised Bowser fell that slow. You would think he would mess himself up. But you know what? It doesn't matter because he has additional air jump. Ooh, that was close. Darkwing's gotta get. He's. He, oh, jeez. He needs to. Don't taunt. Why are you taunting, Kingzilla? Don't taunt. Ooh, nice grab. I thought he was about to up smash him or something. Ooh, that was close. Punish him. Get him again. Don't dash dance. Just hit him. Get him. Punish him. Oh, he missed the up smash. And Bowser's literally throwing... He's roasting him. He wants his chicken wings. Bowser wants his chicken wings. Don't get hit. Get him. Come on, Dark Wings. Get him. Get him. No, 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 no. No, he got thrown. Come on, get the kill, get the kill, get the kill, get the kill. I don't care what you have to do, get the kill. Get the kill. Ah! Why? Why did you? Oh my goodness! Look! Oh wait! Never! Oh my goodness! He was two. He, he was two KOs ahead. I thought that was. Oh right, because he. Oh, because he got the quick kills. Gray Fox versus Blue Boom. This could go very, very bad actually, because Blue Boom is a projectile. How did this get added? I didn't add this. Okay, what the heck? I put. Did I add this by accident? 
Oh my goodness, that, this is actually, I don't think this is legal because it has water in it. Not, well, not water, the stage is too big and, no, nah, never mind. Ooh, you try to fire Fox and you try to burn his circuits. <clears throat> okay, that was actually cool right there. He forward, he went forward and ran back and then he ran back to avoid the attack. That was actually pretty good. Ooh, he almost went for that back air and Blue Boom was like, uh-uh. But he ended up not doing it because he knew it wouldn't hit. Why did you reflect that? Why did you reflect that? Wow. It wasn't even near you and you try to reflect that. Are you kidding me? It doesn't even oh. Oh, Blue Boom is dash dancing. That's just ridiculous. Switching back to the Mega Man stage. Why are these two dash dancing? What are they doing? Blue Boom is in the lead. What are you dash dancing, Gray Fox, you moron? You're losing. Okay, that was good. You reflected that. Too bad you reflected everything else, including his blaster. Okay, you got a KO there, but uh, don't you need like an extra KO? Because if I recall, I think, didn't uh, Blue Boom get him twice or did, was that just once? Oh, he waited. He was like, wait, if I do if I do the up A again, he's going to reflect it. Don't taunt. Don't taunt. You're still losing. You need to, ca you need to catch up. Come on, build some damage. You only got six. You got 15 seconds left. Build some damage. Build some damage. Oh. Uh. GGs. GGs. I saw that happening. You you could tell that he did not know what to do against Mega Man or Blue Boom. Blue Boom literally he, he, if you he, he, this could go. I okay. You felt bad for Soul. You're gonna feel bad for this break because I can tell you. Oh yeah, I did make this. I was like, did I make this legal? I yeah, I did. It, it's legal. For a tournament, it's just a plat. It's just battlefield, but Yoshi story. Yes, yeah, <clears throat> yeah. See, this is what I mean. Oh, if you landed that, I think you would have been KO. Wait, would he have been? I don't know. Oh, see, <laughs> you thought Robin was gonna get whooped by like. <laughs> I knew Robin was gonna lose, but you're like, what? What about this one? Technically, Little Mac should not have problems fighting Peach yet. This one that does, because this speech is a tank. He can't just go up and punch her because he'll 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 get blocked or parried. There we go. There we go. I don't know what percentage she was at, but yeah, that 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 was a powerful punch. He's forced to literally play defensive and go in and, and hit her when she's vulnerable. Or, you know, build up damage, build up the knockout punch, and then send her, send her to oblivion. Got her. Look at that, though. Even if he's very powerful, look, oh. Even if he has a lot of strength, you see how Armonite's just literally just helping her eat the punch or eat the attacks. He literally has to build up damage. Oh, nice. 
<laughs> She's like counter, and he was like counter. Oh, he got thrown. That's, you should have forward smashed. I would have KO'd her. Don't do that. She's going to parry that. Wow, she actually blew that. I thought she was going to parry. She tried to dodge that, but blew it. <clears throat> That's going to parry. Yep, I saw that happening. Yeah, I saw that missing. Because that's what I would have done, but, you know, oh, <laughs> I saw that happening. See, the Florina sees, when over time, she'll realize what you're trying to do, and she knows where the hitbox is going to hit, so she's like, I dare you to hit me, and then you hit her, and it slightly misses, and then she just counterattacks you, and then just bullies you. She doubled countered, are you kidding me? Oh, if you tilted, actually, would I have killed KO? I mean, fist break lost. I think by two KOs, right? I'm too strong, is what she says. She is strong. She is strong to a point. She's not invincible, though. She's not. Oh boy, my eye. I got something in my eye. Dog on it. Not bad, though. I mean, he just needed to get one more KO, and then they would have had sudden death, which probably would have still ended badly. Considering that he's an offense or aggressive type. Oh boy. Hold on a second. I gotta pause this. I gotta pause this real quick. I gotta pause this real quick. Okay, I'm back. Ooh, the excitement got to me. Oops, I forgot to push the play button. There we go. The excitement got to me so much that I uh, had to go to the restroom. Athena versus uh, Blue Phantom. Blue Phantom beat uh, Phantom Dragon. So let's see how he does against Athena. I kind of, I'm a little annoyed that Sonic keeps spin dashing, but I guess that's his way of approaching. Cause I won't lie, I never used a spin dash. I used it a little bit because I was trying to be um, unreadable. Cause if I used the same move, the opponent would know what I'm trying to do. But I mean, do people really use Sonic spin dash to attack or to evade? See, I mean, look how the Amiibo's using the. Don't. What are you doing? Why do my Amiibos taunt? I didn't teach them any of those. Why do they taunt? See, that's what you get for Tana, you idiot! You dumb hedgehog! Seriously, that's what you get. And we got this stage, Pyramithra stage. I'm excited that they're actually releasing, uh, oh, it's that, it's that, it's these two. The female robot and the, uh, I wasn't paying attention. How did he KO her? Did he up air tilt or did he neutral? <laughs> Athena did it right back. I have yet to play Xenoc Xenoblade Chronicles 2. I don't have any intention of getting part 2 yet, but I know that's where this game is from. Part 2. But I need to play part 1, which I got for Christmas, yet I haven't played it yet. I heard that it's a very long game, that there's a lot to do in there. In fact, if I recall, I think it plays like, uh, like those ga games like Tales of whatever. You know, like Tales of Vesperia or the Tales of series? I think it plays similar to that, because there's just a lot of hidden stuff for you to do, which upgrades your team, changes their looks, unlocks weapons, and all that stuff. There's just a lot for you to do in that game. And believe me, games like those... Oof! I mean, it's fun and all, but it's like, when it comes to adding secrets... 
you know, it's like, could you do that, like, at specific spots so we have to, like, go back and retrace our steps to get specific, you know, items or clothes or characters? Ah. Sonic, what are you doing? Are you trying to be evasive? Get her. Oh, she landed. If she did not, if she was... Wow. 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 <laughs> that was crazy. He was about to knock her out. She said nope and then cross counter with a down smash. Okay, I was not paying attention. I should have. I thought for a second they were equal, but Athena was up ahead by one. Hmm, this is going to be interesting. Leaf Knight versus Frost King. And we're right back here at the at the three house. I'm pretty sure we were here before. You know what's really interesting? When they spawn in this stage, they moved uh uh what what's those characters' names? I forgot those characters' name in the background. Um I know one of I know the the I know the two of them are, are father and daughter, but pretend to be brother and sister when they're not. And then there's the priest the the do that there. Who's actually a uh, yeah? Okay. I, I haven't played three houses in a while, so I forgot. Dog on it. I can't remember their names. I can't remember their names. <laughs> it's been that long since I played Fire Emblem Three Houses. Oh man, I need to continue that game just to refresh my memory. Freya, not Freya. Ah, oh, dog on it. That that's from another game. Darn it, I give up. I'm hurting my head. That was a nice parry from Leaf Knight, but Dogman, I can't remember their name. <laughs> Especially the shorter one. I keep thinking her name is Laylet. That's not her name. <clears throat> Why are you not countering that, Leaf Knight? What are you doing? You have a counter. Get him. Yeah, stand there and charge up up smash when he's too high. Oh my goodness. Wow. My amiibos don't know how to deal with King Dedede's, uh, or Frost King's Gordos. Like, they literally keep running into that just to get knocked away. I saw that. King DD knows how to parry, or Frost King knows how to parry. These guys parry when they feel like it. How long has been Frost? Oh my good. Okay, I was about to say, if you got hit by that. Has, has, has Leaf not even got a KO off of Frost King yet? Oh my goodness, I guess. Leaf Knight, what are you doing? <laughs> Finally, you got a kill at the last second. Come on, he couldn't do, he could, he was literally getting, oh my goodness, Frost King literally just kept him at bay, and he's like, what do I do, what do I do, then he gets a kill with a neutral, oh we got two, I thought that was only one, but still, Frost King was two ahead, uh... Okay, I think I already know who's gonna win after the performance you saw against because I mean it was two boss of me But it was him and uh, uh, Meta Knight or Knight and We saw how or Knight tried but was eaten. I'm hoping that the professor can save him. So oh, he tried to spike him 
You gotta win, Professor. You're gonna get your soul eaten if you don't. He parried the pill and then swung the sword at him. No! No! Don't do- Oh my freaking goodness! No! No! This is kind of why I wish I had given Dr. Mario additional air jump. But I, at the time, I didn't have enough. I did, I, or actually, I ran out of uh, Ho-Oh spirits. But I prefer to give him additional air jump because Lightweight does not save him from getting spiked like that. I mean, sure, you jump high, but, you know, Lightweight and additional air jump gives you extra jumps higher. He would have survived that if he had that, but no, it wasn't enough. Don't get smacked. Don't get... Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Stop it. Professor, no. You and Felicia are gone forever. No. Do something. <clears throat> I'm losing my voice because my amiibos. Oh, was it a bad idea to put this big, this big bad... Was it a bad idea to put... Oh, my goodness. It was a bad idea. He's lit. Wait a minute. Oh wait. Okay, that was that was the professor. Oh my goodness, sixty-two percent, and he was at zero. Death. It's it's it's, it's all you can think of with Soul Eater. It's death. <clears throat> no. Soul Eater, spare him. His soul is not worth eating. He's it's not worth eating. You've already devoured or not. You don't need to devour more. <laughs> what have I done? Oh, professor. It's no use. It's no use. <clears throat> Ooh, he dodged that. Yeah, uh, I don't know what you were thinking, Professor. Spinning him around like you did with Luigi. That's not enough. He just ran away and came right back. He's coming back. Why did he double jump? Okay, what the heck is wrong with the game? Why did he use his... He used up his, uh, his double jump. Or additional air jump. Actually, you know what? He, you know, Soul Eater still does need kind of more training because I didn't fully train him. When I say he needs full training, like, I didn't expose him to stuff like items or 1v1s or other things. I just kind of left him alone after I made him hit level 50. So he's kind of learning based on, I guess, from me and the computer, but not from others. So maybe that's why he, you know, he's not familiar. You guys are going to think I'm crazy, but th to me, this is mother versus daughter. I know Rosalina and Peach are not related, but to me, they look, but in my so-called, my so-called imagination, Sacred Wind is the mother to Lovely Wind. They had their ups and downs, but she wants to make sure that she remembers her training, and the fact that she needs to be away. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with this, but it just, to me, it's mother versus daughter. I guess she wants to make sure she's still stable and okay after fighting Bernie So for so long. Because Bernie So was just a... Was a dude who couldn't control himself and was always burning things up. Always destroying and burning things up. And she literally had to keep... She had to keep stopping him and she wasn't a fan of fire. Oh, the Luma. The Luma. And there she goes. There goes the up smash. Ugh. Daisy, or uh, not Daisy, Peach. Rosalind, oh boy, I'm cheering them both on. They're both my favorite amiibos. Oof. I'm actually afraid because what if one of these guys have to face again he has to has to go against Soul Eater? 
Oh boy, the Dragon Quest stage. I've yet to play Dragon Quest 13. I've yet to play it. I don't know which platform I want it on. I think I want to get it on the Switch. Only because on the Switch version, the uh, characters follow you when you're out on the field. While the others is just the... Ooh! That's another one. Well, on the other systems, you're, it's just the protagonist hero that you see. And I kind of do like the idea of other characters following you. It's just nice when you have company, so you don't get it mixed up and think, Who's following me? Oh, it's an enemy versus... Oh, hey, guys. Because, I mean, I wish they did that with Dragon Quest VIII on the 3DS, where you could at least see your characters follow you, then to just press start, and then you speak to them as if they were there all this time. But they weren't. It was just you. 24 seconds left. Who's in the lead? Lovely Wind or Sacred Wind? I want to say, actually, they're tied. They're both hurt, too. There goes the Luma. Bye. Nope. Oh, there goes the knockout there. Come on, loved one. You gotta get a you gotta get a KO. Get her. Get her now. Get her now. Aww. Oh, sudden death. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Stop tackling. Stop tackling. Oh my goodness. I s so Sacred Wind was actually losing. If Lovely Wind KO'd her back, she would have won. Aww. Hmm. Disappointing. You let your you let your weakness. Darn it! I messed up. How disappointing! You exposed your weakness once again, daughter. She actually did expose it. Why would you use the stupid air attack against Rosalina's Luma spinning in your spinning in your face? Oh jeez! Genetic Soul versus General. Genetic Soul literally took poor Rosalina and wiped the floor with his face. What's with those three changing formations? Like, what are they doing? Like, first it was... I guess they change formation every time you spawn in. Did you just disable... Oh my... Oh my goodness, that's disrespectful. General, you gotta do something. I know he's a boss of me, but get him. Oh my goodness, I should've killed. Don't just jump. Get down there and hit him. What is going on? He throws the shadow ball and then tail whips him? Oh my goodness, genetic soul. Oh jeez. He tried to falcon kick only just get kept parried and, and hit with darkness. He did it again! He disables him. Oh, don't you get hit by that. Okay, thank goodness. I was like, that. you should have been able to avoid that. Oh, Genexo so is toying with him. Genexo so is toying with his, with his food. You're thinking, oh, I got, I just hit you. So what? You didn't KO him. Oh boy. General, do something. Thank you. Now you gotta get. You need another win though, because he took two from you. No, don't fall. Don't get KO by the platforms. No, don't get grabbed. Oh my goodness, at least he blocked that. Do not get thrown off the stage. Oh, he's dead. Oh, thank goodness, the stage saved him. Okay, we're back on the King of Fighters Stadium. Come on, you got three fighters watching you. I mean, you had three characters watching you, but they're fighters. The others, never mind. Come on, General. Come on, General, get him. Oh, thank goodness. Why would you... He does not know how to fight a Mewtwo. No, don't get tail whipped. Oh, thank goodness it it, sh it broke but didn't shatter. <laughs> he just used Falcon Punch like you just. Oh, he survived that. He survived that. Another tail whip. <laughs> oh, he tried to land the knee, hit the sour spot though. What the hey? What is going on? Oh my god. Oh, he finally landed the knee. Is I don't think that's enough though. You need to get another KO, I think. You gotta get a quick KO to, to get the, oh, never mind. 
Never mind. It's not possible. The way Mewtwo looks when he's coming down. The way Mewtwo looked when he was coming down remind me of how he looked when he was inside that that little capsule when they first created him. I just realized that when he was falling down. At least that's what it looked like. I don't know if that was a reference, but that looked interesting. Oh boy. So we got Kingzilla versus Blue Boom. Um, I want to say, well, we saw what happened to poor Dark Wings. He got eaten by base. He got roasted, turned into a chicken wing, was eaten. So, oh, why are there trees here? Oh, this is why the stage is banned. And the, there's no bridge this time, so it's you're literally just on an island. So far, Blue Boom's off to a good start. Blue Boom is off to a good start. Oh, yes! Zero to death! He, I mean, it took a lot of attacks, but he got a zero to death. So far, he's untouchable. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness! Oh, if that killed, I would have laughed. Oh, he got burned. Ooh, that was close. Oh, he got par he parried. Don't don't you jump into okay, thank goodness. I'm like, don't you jump into that. You see him charging, don't don't try to fight him. Or don't cr don't challenge that. Could Blue Boom be the one to defeat this? Oh jeez. He got a KO on him. And I think Bowser, I think Kingzilla's angry. He's like, how dare you make a fool of me. Or better yet, the old saying, it's, stop, it's time to stop kidding around. And foot to the face. My, his robotic face. Oh boy, see what I mean when when I said, oh boy, it's the old saying, it's time to stop kidding around. Now he's not kidding around. Now he's giving blue, oh, what the, hey, did he catch that? And Or no, it hit him, but he was, but it didn't phase him. What were you trying to spike? He was above you already. I noticed that he's not using his leaf shield. Actually, to tell you the truth, the amiibo, I taught him to use his leaf shield as a counter, not as a attack. Because it doesn't, it really does very little damage. Oh, thank you. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. He gets pushed by the down air. Parries the uh, dash attack. Only to get up tilt after. <laughs> oh, don't let him break your shield. Don't let him break your shield. Oh, Blue Boo. <laughs> Why? You had him on the ropes, and then you just... You you self-destructed. No. <laughs> what is happening? Oh, Kingzilla advances. I mean, he tried, but doggone it, Bowser. Don't tell me he's going to win my... The boss of the boss of Mevo Florina versus the so-called oh man can Athena beat this this princess of a boss? I hope so. Stop using uh, uh, explosive flames. Get her. Don't use explosive flames unless oh okay you warped away from her. Not that it matters. Eesh. She is weird of using. She's using her projectiles aggressively. Like she goes in, uses auto reticle, which is risky because if it misses, you'll you'll be wide open. 
Okay, can you not spam auto reticle? Like, I think I used that so you would use them more often. Don't spam it. Like, but you know what? That's a good. Uh, you know what? I take it back because she has to build build damage. Oh my goodness! If she doesn't build enough damage, she can't KO Florina. Florina's a walking tank. What else can you do when you have someone that hits that literally does like uh, two punch, two smashes enough to KO you? No. Ooh, parried. I'm just wait. I'm just literally focusing right now. Oh, shoot! I'm thinking Athena. You, Athena may have a chance though until she got attacked by that golf club. Why are you using your? What? What are you doing? Why are you using your projectiles like that? That's not going to save you. That's not enough. Oh my goodness. Okay, she got a kill, but she has to get another one to make a combat. You know what I kind of wish I I wish I taught her how to graph more, cause she's using the projectiles way too much. That's slightly okay, but that's not what you're supposed to do. That's not how you play a theme or Palutena. See, and she's using that way too much. I mean, I'm happy she is, but that's not that's not what I want her to do. Plus, she does not count. Well, she tried countering, but she's not countering enough to block attacks. Athena could not beat her. Athena could not beat Florina because she wouldn't. She didn't know how to keep her distance. You know, she could have done better, but she literally was more distancing than attacking. Why is it Amiibos don't know to just? Oh, forget it. Forget it. I'm not gonna complain. There's just one true answer. I gotta retrain her. I need to retrain her. That's all I gotta do. She and Soul need to be retrained. Ooh, another big boy battle. Frost King versus Soul Eater. Soul Eater ate two fighters, Oronite and the Professor. Is he going to eat this? Is he going to devour the Frost King? If he does, he's really going to become cold hard. What are you doing? If he does, he's. What are you doing? Stop spamming the stupid volcano kick. If he does eat Frost King, so he's gonna be even more cold-hearted. Oh, okay. Okay, don't get don't get ahead of yourself. Yeah, you gotta kill. Good for you. Don't be stupid. No, no. Yes, that's what you get. You try to land that. What are you doing, you dumb penguin? Look what. See, this is what you get for taunting. Stop being an idiot. You've done so. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay. You guys are. Oh my goodness. You guys are. Are you guys. <sighs> Did you seriously try to hit him and then absorb. And then. Oh my goodness. What is happening? You're trying to eat the soul eater. Are you crazy? You're trying to devour him, Frost King? Are you crazy? Why would you want to- Oh, kick to the face. Or stomach, actually. You are- Oh, you know, if you absorb that and spit it out, you could throw it, but I don't think you can hit the Gordo after you summon it, Frost King. Oh, you try to grab him. Yeah, nice try. He's used to that. See? He grabbed you. He hit him during the the fate the morph change. 
You dodged way too early. So leader, I don't know why you're taunting. Stop that. Stop taunting. Stop taunting. Is that gonna kill? Wrong way. Did Soul Eater just roll off the stage? And he just taunted twice in one. Like, what is happening? Did did Frost King like break his circuits? Or I mean, did he, is he broken? What are you doing? What are you doing? That that might okay. That won't kill. That would have killed if he didn't dodge that. What is what are these two doing? What is Soul Eater thinking? Is, is he is he getting indigestion or something? What is happening? Is he what is he thinking that Frost King is a good ally or what? Or is he just so excited he can contain himself? What the hey? He got hit by the Gordo. He threw that. Frost King actually beat Soul Eater. He threw. Soul Eater threw that game. I don't know what he was thinking. Did he just end up having an indigestion? Look. They would have had a sudden death if Soul Eater didn't choke. And look, Soul Eater did more damage. But apparently Frost King was smarter. I guess the fact is that he was all about strength and, what, and ended up trying to use his brain but couldn't and kind of broke. <laughs> oh, man. I want to say this is a fair fight, but it's not. Sacred win. Uh, I love you, but I don't see you winning. Prove me wrong, by the way, but I don't see you beating this abomination. <laughs> he's the strongest Pokemon in the world, even though he's not. He's in a world of Smash. He only defeated one Pokemon, and that's Arasso. <laughs> See what I mean? It's not enough. Dude, why are you losing after being thrown? Why is that one throw is enough to make you fail? What are you doing, Sacred Wind? What are you doing with yourself? What are you doing? What are you doing to yourself? Why, Sacred Wind? Breathe for me. Breathe. Why are you being this way? Okay, we're switching out of... Uh, Midgar into Animal Crossing. Now you'll probably do better. Mm. Nope. <laughs> she keeps getting grabbed. Even though she's not... Wait, she is defense tight. Never mind. Why did you not... Never mind. I'm not gonna complain anymore. I'm not gonna complain. Should I should I ban you to the next time I make a tournament? Comment below if I should ban Genetic Soul because I think uh, I did actually get it, put him through some training so he would become smarter, and I think that that worked because now he knows exactly how to take his opponents out one v one, and that means if this was a double team, he could either it could be a poison him or it could be a oh never mind I I don't know I don't know I don't know. What was that? He warped into he warped and re reappeared in the same spot. What is he doing? Five, four, three, oh wow, she hit him there. That, wow, do you see that? She's going in. Sacred Wind is going in. Oh, if that spike. Oh, it didn't spike.
414 versus 203. Doggone it. Oh boy. Round or semifinals, I meant to say. Kingzilla versus Florina. Who's gonna win? The Kingzilla himself or Florina? Because funny thing is, is that these two fought in the past, I think. But I think it was before I gave Bowser a retrain, so I think this might be his first... No, it's not his first time. Well, no, it is. It's his first time 1v1-ing her, but he did fight her in, like, free-for-alls and such. But I don't know if that makes a difference. That only did 10%. Oh my goodness, stop spamming that. Stop spamming forward smash. I know it's your strongest move, but do something else. She's a tank. I know you need to break the wall, but that's not the way. That's not the way. I mean, if Florina loses, well, the boss has been defeated. If King Zilla loses, well, all the all the times he's bullied the other amiibos will be avenged. Oh, jeez. But then it's it'll be her versus whoever wins on the other side. In fact, who's gonna verse Genetic Soul? Hey, he got a kill or a KO. I mean. Stop taunting, you idiot! I get it, she's Princess Peach, you wanna kidnap her. You're not gonna kidnap her if you if you lose, you idiot. Of course. Oh my goodness! No, you did not. Did you get? Did you see Florina do, like doing the tea bag? No, 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 no. You're getting a whooping. You're getting a whooping for that, Princess. Get out of here. What are you doing? <laughs> the more stage messed him up. He was not aware that. It, oh, Bowser, why? Why? Why would you throw like that? He's not aware that from Zelda to the uh, to the battlefield. Dog on it. He's like, why does the ground feel weird? Oh, because the because it disappeared. Oh my gosh! Now look at what look what Florina's doing. She's whooping him all because he goofed in the end. He did beat her once though in the past, but. That doesn't mean that Florian didn't adapt. Yeah, he's not kidnapping her this time. Oh, if that hit again, I think... Actually, never mind. I was going to say, if he hit her with the forward air again, I think that would have KO'd. But you know what? I don't... Never mind. It probably would not have. Get hit her. She's a, actually, you know what? She won. She won because you, 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 you hesitated. <sighs> you hesitated. You blasted Koopa. Yeah, look disappointed as she walks away while you're laying on the ground hurt. Look disappointed, Koopa. You failed to capture the princess. Oh, Frost King. At Frost King, I expect you to do really well against Genetic Soul. After all the crazy, like you beat, you beat Soul Eater, even the Soul Eater malfunction. Come on, show us what you can do. Show us what you can do. Get him. No, I'm not liking what I'm seeing. Stop it. Don't stop taking damage. Deal damage, not receive it. You're at 103. That's no good. You gotta you gotta hit him. Don't let him grab you. Thankfully you're heavy, but oh no. Oh I don't know why he charged up. Ooh, your gordo is about to go right into your head. Why do you keep trying to tackle him or dash attack him? Stop it! Frost King, it doesn't work! 
Oh my goodness. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? Oh good. Oh, he should have punished that. He, he should have punished that. Froskin, you gotta adapt. You gotta do something. Mewtwo is not someone you can... Okay, good. You always gotta go for the dash deck. Stop that. He's not falling for it. Okay, you need to get closer to use that hammer. Genexo did the same thing that Kingzilla did. He 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 lost the key KO'd because of this stage morph. If it's a very very large stage and the morph happens, it goes from large to a platform stage. Apparently, they're not aware of it. Dog on it. Dog on it. And I say again. Doggone it. What are you doing? Why would you warp? What are you doing? Are you throwing on purpose because you feel undefeated? Are you trying to find a challenge? What are you doing, Genetic Soul? Oh my goodness. Did you see that? He did the uh, dash attack. And, she, and I thought that was going to kill him. And he just dodged it. Lanny Lad must have saved him. I don't know. Why does Frost King why is he not why does he keep going for that? Why is he going for the dash attack? Grab him, thank you. Oh now you wanna do something. Okay. Get him, get him, get it oh are you kidding me? Frost King, why would you dude dude Frost King, why would you do that? You had it! You threw in the end! Why would you why would you dodge when he was not even close enough? You had the win. You could all you had to do was grab him. Frost King. Oh, you were the underdog. You died from it. Now it's now it's two boss amiibos. Florina versus Genetic Soul. I really wanted you to be the, there. I didn't want oh, darn it, Frost King. Doggone it, Frost King. The two most cuckoo cuckoo amiibo that I have. One that's just smart and powerful, the other that's powerful and defensive and weird. Who's gonna win? Florina or Genetic Soul? They both have Armor Knight. Okay, that was actually epic. He ran from it instead of blocking it. Okay, so far Genetic Soul is saying it'll be me, not you. I'm so mad that I'm so annoyed about Frost King. He had that win. You saw him go for it. He actually meteored him or meteor spiked him and then went after him and took him out again. Said, Ah, oh, I'm taking you out now. And then he just threw in the end because he got nervous. He's like, Sudden death, I thought I was dead. Now you're dead. <sighs> This battle, I'm not gonna lie, is not that exciting because two of them, because I wanted Frost King to freeze everyone. No, now it's just gonna be destroyed by Genetic Soul. And obviously, Genetic Soul knows how to fight a Peach. <clears throat> so, who should I ban the next time I decide to do a tournament? Should I ban Florina? Should I ban Genetic Soul? Should I ban Soul Eater? Since they were the ones that were scary. So other mules have a chance to shine. And as I said, uh, two amiibos I know are going to get are going to get retrained. And that would be Soul, aka Robin, and Athena slash Palutena. Because Palutena does not know how to land her blasted projectiles. So the question is, how do I make her better so she learns to hit with the projectiles? Because I won't lie, the train that I gave her at the time could have been better. Oh, 
Okay, Florida, I guess, is trying to make a combat. Whoa! I thought he was about to KO himself. No, he, he moved to the left to grab the ledge. It is possible, I think, to do that. You push up B, get off the ledge, and then just go back and grab it. But I don't know if it works on all characters. See, it works on him, though. See, he's aware of that. Oh, I was going to say, are you going to get hit? No. Yeah, I think genetic still, ha genetic still has this in the bag. I'm trying to think, when did when was the last time Peach KO'd him? Was, did, did she at least get one KO or or not? I can't, I wasn't paying attention to the uh to the damage. What you call it? To the damage percentage. <clears throat> and of course, genetic still taunted because he knew he won. He knew he had won. I am the strongest Smash fighter and Pokemon in the world, says Genetic Soul. Oh, so she did get a KO off of him. Well, there you have it. The one who won the tournament, or this tournament, is Genetic Soul, aka Mewtwo. Yeah, <laughs> but, you know, I am proud of him. I actually did not think you two would do this well because he used to he used to do he used to be blah, blah, blah. he used to be terrible when I first trained him. So you know what? I'm happy that he won. So the question is, should I do another tournament in the future? Obviously, two are going to get retrained, and I might switch out a couple of characters this time. Um, so that way, every amiibo you've seen will have a chance, like Shard Blade, Shine Blade, Moon Witch, Shadow Heart. They all didn't get a chance to come in, and then there's another amiibo that I didn't bring in that I retrained, but I'll probably bring him in next time. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this tournament. Sorry if I, you know, screamed a little, because again, my amiibos, hey BSL, and bye. But I'm um, sorry if I screamed a little, because, you know, I got excited and also disappointed. Um, yeah. So, these are my amiibos. I'm proud of them. At the same time, though, I'm a little salty with them. And do keep an eye out, because I'm thinking about taking these guys online so other players can fight them. So if you see Starlight or anything, you know, be, feel free to join, because I'm literally testing them to see how well they fight, as well as having them fight fair. But until then, 